All right, it's my last run on my training cycle. The Omaha half is on Saturday. So, been training for, uh, I don't know, three months maybe, something like that. Maybe four, maybe I got serious in January. I don't know. Didn't really train much last year. A little bit, did the trial of miles thing in August. But uh, that's really about it. Once I knew the Hitchcock half was going to be canceled, postponed, I kind of shelved the training and didn't really mess with it. So did a little bit. But the school year, I've been lifting a bunch and got serious about my training. And I think, uh, well, mildly serious. I skipped a few runs. But uh, I'm going to try for a uh, PR on Saturday. That's a little 138 so anything below that will be sufficient I'd be happy with that so that is the goal so we'll head up to Omaha on Friday after school and Saturday morning is the race first in-person race in a little while so looking forward to that but Finishing up my last easy run here, just doing the cool down, walking the bigs. Say hello, Barley. <laughs> so, I guess wish me luck. Steve's house, 
Picked us, fixed us some hamburgers, so pretty good deal. It's out here uh, hooking up the chariot for on Megan's bike so she can uh, bike Holden to the starting line tomorrow. And uh, that was the wrong trailer bracket on her bike. And I was like, oh man, kind of having a little panic attack there. And lo and behold, the bicycle gods. The correct bracket is on my bike. <laughs> so we got saved, we got lucky there. Good morning. Got the packet picked up, two ninety nine. So already got my medal. So I'm just gonna sit in the car, hang out. I think. So ah, uh, I'll miss this. The people running around and everybody's all excited to run a bunch of stupid miles. It's a good feeling. Walking back to the car so I can throw my stuff in there. I might even try and park a little closer. Yeah, I don't feel that ambitious. Just leave it over here in the parking garage. So, actually on time this morning. What? I don't know how much recording I'll do during the run, since I'm trying to run fast. But 138.09, that's the goal. Though there will be another small event, soldiers carrying 35 pound packs, thank them for their service and uh, you'll see them along the way and uh, applaud for them. And, uh, Thank the volunteers at the water stops. Again, we have water out there, snacks when you're done. And uh, we're gonna dismiss you real slow so that you spread out on the trail. You can take your masks off as soon as you get through the start. There's trash cans along the way, or better yet, put them on your wrist and have them when you're done or in your pocket. Uh, thanks for coming. We're gonna get you going here in about one minute. And uh, good luck, run fast, and uh, enjoy the day. Well, I made it. Hold on. She's doing her own. Ah, <laughs> uh, like 148 or something like that. Huh? Nothing. <laughs> Turnarounds in, was into the wind. I kind of sucked. Killed my pace, so. But it's a good run. It's a good course. Real flat, and easy going. So I would suggest it. It's a real nice finish area too. Real open. So, not quite the pace I wanted, not quite the time I wanted, but it's still just fine. It's been a, over a year since I've raced anything. So, gonna probably ride the bikes for a little bit. Should be a good time. Well, we're on our bikes, because, uh, you know, what do you do after running a half marathon? You ride your bikes. So, that's what we're doing.
We walked back on the trail. Todd and I each picked up a handful of nails off the trail. So Steve's still fixing his tire. There I got it. After fixing the tire, we decided just to bike back. That place, some type of bakery, Steve says, smells delicious. Could be, could be because I'm just hungry, but uh, it smells like Pop Tarts. It's a nice, pleasant smell on the uh, bike trail. <laughs> better than a dead animal. Yeah, better than a lot of things. So, Megan and Kathy are up ahead somewhere. They're, I don't know, riding fast and talking about girl things, probably. So, we are uh, planning an adventure in June as Megan's going on. <clears throat> She's got an Usborn conference, book lady conference. So, I've got Harper and Hinton and Hatcher, and if I'm gonna stay home with them by myself, we might as well go on an adventure. So, trying to figure something out. Tiny gloves. Tiny gloves. <laughs> How long does it take you guys to get there? Like 20 hours. 20 minutes, maybe. Yeah, this is what normal people do, right? <laughs> yes? Yeah. I'm pretty sure this is what normal people do. Oh, it's a hill. It is a hill. <laughs> no, it's on top of the hill. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Hello, puppy. It's okay, puppy. No. <laughs> Run a half marathon. And then bike all over town. I don't know where Maggie is. She's back there somewhere. Normal people. For sure. Kiss, 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 kiss. 